Welcome to all of you, my dear friends. I am Vinay Ramat, and in this video, we are going to learn. I hope this video will be will be very uh, helpful to all of them who all are willing to learn English and uh, from the scratch. Okay, and this video is also helpful for them who all are don't who all are want to uh, check their or judge their English grammar. Okay, now we are going to see without further delay. Here and uh, now, here I don't have board here. If I could have. perhaps uh, it will be, this video will be very interactive and explain uh, descriptive but it is not like that here i orally i have to explain the examples so please listen me carefully sorry for that i am begging pardon in front of you all thank you so much for listening me carefully thank you and uh, watch it till the end now um, just we have to take the examples how i am going to decode the english grammar how to identify how to learn english i will tell you in this video okay if you take any one example of english okay i will tell you uh, okay one second as you can take the example vinay is going to college okay vinay is going to college it is a uh, sentence of english and it is according to grammar okay first we have to check the grammar at least okay means in what tense it is this is in continuous tense present continuous tense how to identify if you have if you know the structure of a present continuous tense then you will identify easily okay how subject plus am is are plus vng plus object this is the uh, present continuous tense structure of english grammar okay and the um, and make sure that we in which sentence it is it is in present tense the present continuous tense i have already told you subject plus am is are plus vng plus object here vinay is going to college it is according to the present continuous tense now uh, we have to know the meaning of that that sentence if you know then you will use then you can use it in your day to day life and you have to pronounce you will um, you should have to learn english thoroughly i mean you will learn english thoroughly by this way this way you will improve this is my strategy i don't have to disclose but uh, my uh, more friends my all the friends are asking me to prepare video about it so that is why i am making okay now vinay vinay is going to college vinay college ge hoguttiddane continuous means what continuous tense i have uh, announced continuous tense means what the work when the work is in progress when the work will be in progress you have to uh, decide that is in present continuous tense not in present uh, i mean it is not completed yet and uh, we are not going to start yet we have already started but it this, this work is in progress but not yet completed that's you call the work is in progress at that time we have to call it as continuous tense and it is in present continuous tense because is is there okay i hope you got it uh, in kannada also i have meaning i uh, told you and i will paste the examples in the last i have uh, segregated i have decode deco uh, i have made the decode of english grammar according to the tenses what i am going to tell you i will paste you can check okay now vinay is going to college now vinay means what you have to check vinay is he uh, in this sentence it is working as a object or uh, as an as a subject and uh, the college is the object okay and here uh, apart from it what is the work of the word vinay vinay is proper noun okay proper noun the uh, exact name of the person exact name of the people um, the thing or animal that's you call the proper noun now apart from it vinay means what humble okay that's all another is is auxiliary verb is there this is used for uh, also called as helping verb and uh, the is which used for only uh, singular nouns singular nouns or singular pronouns not for plurals okay that's all is is which situated uh, in present tense this is the present auxiliary okay that's all now moving on to the another when i is going going is go is a main verb and we added ing to it to show uh the uh, progress okay the continuous tense that's we call we the uh, uh, so that is why this is according to the english grammar present continuous tense going to to is what to is the preposition here which shows the direction okay now college college is an object okay apart from it 
college is called the education um, where the uh, mentors and students gather the mentor which teach and uh, the students uh, which they learn that's you call the college that is one gathering that's you call the classroom or college and that is the meaning of college and the, this is here it is acting as an object i hope you cleared about it thank you so much and i will paste the examples in the last thank you so much for listening me carefully thank you